the scientific name for reindeer is Rangifer tyrannus. In Latin, both Rangifer and tyrannus mean reindeer. Rangifer is a generic name, and tyrannus is a specific name. Most reindeer are found in the Northern Hemisphere. Their habitats are mostly near the Arctic, such as Norway, Iceland, Sweden, Finland, Russia, Alaska, Canada, and Greenland. Reindeer have been largely domesticated in Russia and Scandinavia. The number of free-living reindeer in the wild is lower today. Herds usually live in the food-abundant tundra, mountains, and forests of Europe, Asia, and North America. These forests with pine, spruce, and other conifers are also ideal for protection from predators. Reindeer vary in size in each species. On average, female reindeer weigh about 240 pounds and male reindeer weigh about 365 pounds. Reindeer have developed thick fur that covers their bodies against the cold conditions of the Arctic. This fur traps air and helps keep the animal warm. The hairs of the reindeer's fur are hollow. This allows them to swim better in water. Because reindeer migrate regularly, they have less difficulty crossing rivers. Interestingly, another arctic creature that has a similar characteristic thanks to its fur is the polar bear. Unlike bears, reindeer usually have a light beige color and different shades of brown. They may also have white spots on their chest, belly, neck, and hooves. These animals are constantly on the move in these cold regions and their hooves are very useful. The hooves are large, hard, and strong enough to break the ice. In warmer seasons, the hooves become a little softer. This gives them the ability to grip mud and water. Reindeer have 25% more blood-carrying capillaries in their noses than humans. Therefore, more blood flows through their noses. This means that the nose stays warm in cold climates. Like many mammals, reindeer do not sweat. Their extraordinary snouts help regulate the animal's internal body temperature. The eyes of reindeer are different colors in summer and different in winter. Their eye color changes from golden in summer to blue in winter. This is not just a color change. Their pupils and iris muscles change. This allows them to see better in the darkness of winter and to protect their eyes in the daylight of summer. Both male and female reindeer are the only species of deer that grow antlers. Antlers can grow up to 50 inches in males and 20 inches in females. The antlers grow from a stub in the front bone of the skull called a pedicle. These bony horns take in oxygen. They are covered with a hairy skin called velvet, which is lined with blood vessels. Male reindeer have larger antlers than females. The velvet covering the antlers of males tends to fall off from the end of August. Females do not shed it until spring. A reindeer can run up to 50 miles per hour. Reindeer migrate regularly and are constantly on the move. These animals can travel as far as 3,100 miles in a year. They usually go on long journeys during the summer months. Animals that live in herds also travel in herds. When the weather gets colder in the fall, the herd population decreases. In spring, herds can grow from 50,000 to 500,000 members. Reindeer like large herds. Male reindeer often leave the group and roam alone. The herd that stays behind is mostly made up of females and cubs. Predators such as avalanches, wolves, bear martens, lynxes, and bears are deadly threats to them. In addition, rock eagles and ravens see reindeer cubs as prey. Humans are also one of the biggest predators of reindeer. Reindeer are herbivores. Their favorite foods are willow and birch leaves, mushrooms, sedges, cotton grass, and ground vegetation. Eating too much natural fruit can harm their health. In cold and snowy seasons, they use their keen sense of smell to find lichens under the snow. They break through the snow and ice cover with their hard hooves to reach the food. The average reindeer consumes 9 to 18 kilos of food a day. Classified as herbivores, they can consume small rodents for their protein and iron needs. But they don't much prefer this. 
the breeding season for reindeer lasts from the beginning of September until the end of November. The male reindeer selects between 5 and 15 females from the herd and forms his own harem. A reindeer pregnancy lasts 7.5 months. The doe leaves the herd to calve and enters a common calving ground in the spring. They give birth one calf at a time. The birth of twins is rare. Calves suckle for the first weeks. After that, solid foods are added to their diet. It takes six months for the baby to be completely weaned. For the first year, they stay with their mother. The life expectancy of reindeer in the wild is about 15 to 18 years. However, animals in captivity and domesticated animals have a much shorter lifespan. In North America, the domesticated species are called reindeer or caribou, while in Europe all deer are called reindeer. People hunt these animals for meat, pelts, and fur. People use reindeer fur to create warm clothing for extremely cold weather. They also use reindeer skins to make shoes, tents, and clothes. Humans domesticated reindeer a long time ago. Domesticated reindeer are often short-lived because they do not live according to their nature. It is difficult for them to be exploited by humans, to be used as a material, to be turned into a means of transportation. Since these creatures do not have a suitable habitat and are under pressure from humans, they die in a short time due to depression, illness, and starvation. The total population of reindeer in the world is about 2.1 million individuals. In 1996, there were about 4.7 million reindeer. Humans are the main reason why the population has declined so much. Over the years, reindeer and the regions they inhabit have become heavily dependent on humans. Expanding urbanization, hunting and captivity for entertainment and fur, and the changing climate due to global warming are the main reasons for this decline. Increasing populations of wolves and bears are threats to reindeer among the natural causes. According to some scientists, the world has now entered a new period of mass extinction. While science is discovering new animal species every day, it is also adding some extinct animals to the extinct list. Like many animals, the future of reindeer seems to depend on humans. Thank you.